gallbladder essentially has a storage function. Um, bile is produced by your liver. It's stored in your gallbladder between meals, and then it's pushed out into your intestinal tract to help you break down, digest, and absorb fats from your diet. Despite its role in our digestion, we can live without our gallbladder. When it becomes problematic, doctors commonly take it out. The two most common reasons to have to have the gallbladder removed are number one, having stones within the gallbladder that intermittently will cause pain or nausea or bloating when you eat. Another reason for removal is when the gallbladder isn't doing its job. It's just not functioning appropriately and causing abdominal pain, bloating, etc. Gallbladder surgery used to be a major undertaking, but thanks to advances in laparoscopic techniques, surgeons are able to remove the gallbladder without opening the abdomen. The vast majority of gallbladder surgeries performed laparoscopically nowadays through three or four five millimeter to one centimeter incisions on the belly. That takes the place of a six to eight inch scar, either below the rib cage or above the belly button. The laparoscopic procedure is done under general anesthesia and has a quick recovery time. After surgery, I'll advise patients to avoid fried fatty and greasy foods for a brief period after the surgery until the body gets used to the fact that the gallbladder is no longer there. And so if you can't live with it, there's a surgical solution to help you live without your gallbladder. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.